Hello, it's Saturday the 3rd of August. This is the Fletcher Aeroflight GTO. She's a 14 foot. Um, she's, I think, late 80s, early 90s. I have, in my time, put new seats on her. They had the original back to back, so I didn't like that, I didn't think it was safe enough. So put four forward facing seats in, put a new finishing on the floor. Um, months before I owned her, she had a new Teleflex steering system put in. The dials and everything are working as they should be. The tilt and trim works. The tilt gauge was working last time I used it and it seems to be saying where it is now. I don't know why. It's not a huge issue. Um, here's the engine. It's an Evinrude 60 horsepower two stroke. It is it's the same as the boat really. I mean, it, it is what it is. It's It's got his marks, it's got his battle wounds, but she's really sound. For the age, again, generally a really nice gel coat finish. One or two small repairs there, uh, again, before my time. And a couple of marks where obviously she'd been loaded onto the trailer before. Uh, it's a snipe trailer, again. I mean, they're, they're, they're built really well. There's a, there's a few rust spots on it. Um, again, showing its age a little bit, but she's a really smart and tidy boat. I'll show you down the other side. The lights, nav lights all working. This screen, was put in new by me um, about 10 months ago and she's not actually been out on the water since putting this new screen in. Um, she is, she's a good, honest, first family boat, which is exactly what she was for us. I'll uh, just turn the engine on now so you can see that she starts up. Uh, I have already started it because it's the first start of the season, but now that she is warm, she should be fine. Yes. 